Samurai Choto brand can really take us, you know what I mean? Like I dish, like I that. Do you want the bit put it to touch? Slow and fast, just give it to me, give it to me, watch. Ah, me never on board. That would become a photo, good or what? Ah, put a dog. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Yimura. Yimura, I chose to keep up with the vibes. Thank you so much for joining us today. I hope that you like the content that I serve on this channel and of course, hope that you stay. If you're a returning subscriber, one watches my videos on a regular. Thank you so much for coming back today. I hope that you like today's video and of course, I hope that you stay. Okay, I hope that you stay. No, I hope that you got a friend. Thank you so much to Halara for sponsoring this week's vlog. I love everything actively. I love everything actively. Halara was kind enough to send me a few of their products and today I'm going to be trying them on for you guys giving you guys a review of what I think about them this is the packaging you guys can already see pink yeah 10 pieces in total that I'm going to be trying on for you guys today and of course before we actually get into the trying on portion I want to let you guys know that I have a discount code guys it is a 15% discount code it's showing on the screen right now Choto15 Choto15 feel free to use my discount code when you're checking out your items from Halara in this haul I will be wearing the new in Halara cloud for 3.0 newest leggings and the pattern of leggings as well it basically develop leggings where you can simply pat it off because of the great material that they use these halara cloud for leggings are made from a special fabric that was made by halara to show that there's a 24 7 wear please note that all products that i'm going to be wearing are going to be listed down below in the description box just click on the link okay starting us off i look like a tennis player and i should be playing in the u.s open guys i absolutely love this pink set this is the cloudful air fabric comfy high-waisted tennis skirt got this in a size extra small matching top as well and this is the in my feels air fabric cloudful top both in a size extra small both in the color nose gay one thing about halara is that they have a range of colors the thing that i also love about this brand is how how inclusive they are when it comes to their sizing all the way from petite all the way through to extra large guys they are very very inclusive and that means that they have something for everyone and that also just shows that they made the outfits and they made these clothes they actually had everyone in mind and they were not really targeting one specific group of people and I absolutely love that this is actually a crossover two-in-one thing guys it's basically a sport because guess what it has shorts right underneath it it also has side pockets let me put something in there for you guys so let's pretend that my calculator is actually a phone a bit big but yeah your phone can slide right in there as you guys can see this is a calculator and it fits perfectly real thing you know absolutely absolutely love this set really like the waistband it is stretchy it is padded as well which means that you don't have to worry about the girls because they can be sitting nice and pretty look at the detail that is at the back the crisscross there and the color let me show that something I'm gonna travel in the set with my pink suitcase and I'm gonna be looking like that girl. These are the Cloudful Fabric High Waisted Leggings and I got them in black and in a size extra small. As you guys can see, they fit me nice and snatched, okay? Can we also talk about the waistband again? Let's up a bit. I absolutely love leggings that have this type of design when it comes to the waistband. This V thing, this crisscross thing, I feel like it really just complements your waistline and it just makes it look more... They have side pockets, very, very stretchy. As you guys can see, I can do some, you know, some high kicks. <laughs> extremely, extremely comfortable. They actually go all the way down to my ankles, but then you guys can't really see with the angle that I had before. They are not see-through at all. These are absolutely comfortable. I've changed and I'm now wearing a different pair of items. These are the high-waisted side pocket shaping leggings or training leggings, if you'd like to call them that. And these actually don't go all the way down to my ankles. I'll show you guys just now. This is the Cloudful Fabric, a 
neck top with an open hole got this in solitary style guys absolutely love this top however this thing here is a bit loose and i'm pretty sure that's just because maybe of the sizing or something like that guys this is what the back of the top looks like and the back of the tights as well really really like how they feel and i also really like these leggings they're really comfortable and again they have the side pockets to show you guys that they don't go all the way down to my ankles these are just my socks by the way these are actually seven eight leggings which means that they don't go all the way down they feel like I could do a lot in them. You get what I mean? These are two products that I've decided to put together because I think they look really, really cute. This is the double strapped, backless, twisted, cropped top. And this is what the bag looks like, guys. How cute is this detail of the bag? I got it in an extra small. As you guys can see, again, it is padded. And I also got another pair of the cloudful leggings with a side pocket, a waistband that does the V, the thing that really, really complements your waistline. Again, a moment for the bag because it's absolutely gorgeous these are high-waisted in this waistband as well it is very very comfortable and it is stretchy high kicks and this has to be probably one of my faves from halara the patted off pet resistant leggings and of course i got them in this pink color and i absolutely love them i got them in a size extra small and they fit me perfectly again the waistband is doing what the waistband is supposed to do really really like this detail that it has over here and to actually show you guys the effect of these i'm going to compare these to my other leggings another pair of leggings that i got from a different brand a while back obviously i don't have a pet here with me but i'm just going to use my fur blanket because you guys know that that blanket is always fighting with me so we're going to wrap this on guys the fact that nothing is even sticking to it is speaking volumes but there's absolutely nothing or like the little bits that are there i can literally just brush them off if i do this you guys see that difference i'm pretty sure you guys can pick up the fur and if i try to do this it doesn't come off and i actually need to get um a lint roller i got these drawstring side pocket cargo pants i just wanted something that was you know a little bit more gangster i got them in a size extra small and as i said they are a drawstring type of thing so you can pull this to adjust them to your sizing this brings us to the end of this clothing haul thank you so much to alara for sponsoring this week's vlog i absolutely love Love all the pieces that I got from Halara. I think my favorite ones have to be the pink sets that I wore first, the black cloudful tights, and also the Houtnik top. Also, really, really like the pageant of tights that I wore just now. Thank you so much to Alara for sponsoring this week's vlog. Please do make sure that you check out all the information that is down below in the description box. Make sure that you check out their website as well. And please do feel free to use my discount code, which is showing on the screen right now. The vlog is starting right now.
today I woke up wanting to listen to Hannah Montana. Welcome back to the start of a new vlog. I don't really know what's going on with this angle, but this is a Sunday reset type of video. Basically, a day in my life is I reset on a Sunday. About to get into week 10 of school. So, two more weeks of classes left. I'm really, really happy about that. To be fair, it's literally one week because in week 11, we don't really have lectures. I think I only have one class on the Thursday because most of the lectures are like it's revision week. They'll just like post a summary on the unit sites. Anyways, so technically, this is Sunday reset into my last week of classes, technically. I've just had my breakfast and right now I want to do my laundry, but I also want to do my assignment. Guys the whole weekend and i'm not even kidding you guys the whole of yesterday i was doing this prank report remember that prank report i said it's due in two weeks i'm starting it now i started it but did i continue doing it no i think i only did it like three other times after that and i'm glad that i did that much still but it just wasn't enough for me to actually get it done on time it's only supposed to be 10 pages but then the thing is the calculations sweetie low i'm about to finish it i'm gonna finish it today and submit it it's 12 39 right now i'm gonna start it at 1 p.m i will be done by 4 p.m without fail like i'm not even kidding you guys this weekend i told myself that i was gonna rest and like sit out on the porch like on the little balcony thing that we have on res and just like enjoy the sun because it's getting warmer i'm trying to put my leg here so i was like i really really want to go and just sit out there this weekend and i haven't done that and i'm going to do that today so by 4 p.m i'll be done with this assignment i'm gonna sit out and i'm gonna have some yoga i did majority of the stuff yesterday i have one more calculation to do then i just have to do the discussion part i don't like assignments that give me anxiety you know when you start getting like assignment anxiety and i think you guys know what i mean when you know that one assignment that's just grilling you and just eating you up that's literally how i feel about this thing like your son like, it's not fun it's not cute i genuinely just can't wait to wake up without academic stress and just like chill and do whatever i want for almost day also this is the last assignment for this class so i guess that's why it's fucking eating me up like this now i'm done ranting it's actually the end of the day laundry is right there let me show you guys i'm also washing my bedding today i have quite a bit of laundry to do in the evening today i need to start editing my vlog because i have a vlog that is due tomorrow it's a daily vlog so it shouldn't be that hard for me to edit but then also recently i've been underestimating the amount of work that i have to do so maybe let me not think about that i'll come back for this bag actually i don't need to come back for it i can just take it with me
I've just submitted my assignment. I feel like I'm breathing, but like it's so painful for me to breathe. I swear I could cry right now, guys. Yo. Mm -mm. Like, this assignment almost took me out for real. My eyes are sore. I feel like I can't even really, like, open them. And I'm, like, squinting. Like, yo, guys. Hi, yeah, yeah. Yo. You know when you just get hot flashes? Yeah. That's what this assignment had me doing. Mm -mm. I feel like my whole weekend, guys, I was just stressed. But it's okay. Better days are coming. Better days are coming. I said that I would have finished by 4. It's actually 4.11. So I finished like 11 minutes after the time that I said I'd finish. My laundry is done as well. I actually forgot to film doing my laundry. But then I was like, you guys have seen me doing my laundry before. So like there's no point. Right now I'm going to go sit outside as I promised myself. Yo guys. Mm -mm. Engineering, 2 out of 10. I do not recommend. I'm just playing. If you want to study engineering, go for it. Just know that it will tussle. It will fight you. Mm, guys, come. Mm -hmm. Language <laughs> try to show you guys the time when you guys clearly cannot see I'm about to start editing my vlog which is supposed to come out tomorrow the vlog is really not that long so it shouldn't be that hard for me to edit it fingers crossed also i almost forgot to say the most important thing in today's vlog guys nominations i popped them on the screen right now and we made it for three guys not one not two 
my three guys categories and i'm so happy i'm so blessed to be in this position and i can't wait to see what else we can achieve we made it to like the finalists right and then now i'm asking you guys to please vote for me so that i win in the different categories that i was nominated under and i ended up getting nominated for the young achievers awards media personality slash media outlet of the year and the social influencer and people's choice so three different categories guys now i'm kindly asking you guys again to please vote for me guys the link to vote is going to be down below in the description box all you have to do is click on it and then it literally takes you to the page where you vote all you have to do is just scroll down you see my name under the three different categories so you click on my name and then you press a vote and your vote is in you can only vote every 24 hours which means that you can vote every single day but then like you can only vote once in that 24 hour period set your alarms for every day i don't know if you want to vote for me at 9 a.m set your alarm for 9 a.m every day until the 22nd of october so voting closes on the 22nd of october and i'm really really praying guys that we win i'm gonna leave it all to god let's see where the samurai choto brand can really take us you know what i mean please do share with your friends your family Family, everyone and remember guys you can vote every 24 hours three categories yeah it's giving your favorite youtuber making big moves and i absolutely love that for myself anyways thank you guys so much for watching this vlog i hope that you guys enjoyed my little sunday reset i was stressed for the first half because of the assignment but i managed to hand that in and we are vibing and we're cruising again i hope to see you guys in my next one bye